Hi, welcome to new video of BTH. You must have come across a simple file sharing website like this one. So is it difficult to create such a website? The answer is no. In this video I will show you how to create such a website. First, you need to enable internet information services on your Windows computer. For the rest of the video I will call Internet Information Services as IIS. After installing IIS, a default web page will be created. I will use this default site to create a simple file sharing site. In IIS, right click default website and select add virtual directory. You define a virtual directory that corresponds to the data store, where the files you want to share. Under Features, select Directory Browsing and click Enable. You just need to configure that for your site. Now let's check the results. I will add a simple text file to share with everyone. Then open any web browser and go to my share page. As you can see, I've got a simple sharing site. I advise you not to share important data in this way as it is not secure. But what if you still want to use it and want to share it over the internet? We will find out in the next steps. To easily access the shared website, you need to assign your computer a static IP address. Next, you need to forward port 80 on your router. Different router brands have different port forwarding methods, learn how to do it. You forward port 80 to your computer's IP address, in this example that address is 10.11.32.85. Once the port forwarding is done, you can access the file sharing website using the public IP address from anywhere. If you want to have domain name and update public IP address in case you use dynamic public IP address then I recommend Dynu. It's free. You sign up for an account and create an easy to remember domain name. Next. Install the Dyna client to automatically update your public IP address. Here I have created a domain name for myself and I will assign it to my sharing site. That's it, now you can share files with anyone anywhere with a simple web page. Thank you for watching. If this video is helpful, please like, share and subscribe to my channel.